Hey there, it's Andrew. Just wanted to take a minute and update you on the real estate market. It's now October and fall is here and we're enjoying all of those things. I hope you're appreciating this awesome weather. Um, but I just want to take the time to give you the real state of real estate. Uh, things are still going strong. Deals are still being done and it's a great time to buy or sell. And if you're interested in that, I would love to talk with you more about it. But I wanted to share just a few quick stats with you. Uh, as always, if you find this helpful, give me a quick like uh, on the video. And if you don't want to miss any future videos, then hit that subscribe button. It would really help me uh, to continue to get that feedback. But whether you're a buyer, a seller, or just interested in real estate, uh, I have a few stats here to share with you over the next minute or so that uh, you might find useful. One of the first stats that I like to share is the month's worth of inventory currently on the market. So this is hypothetically, if we had no other listings come onto the market, how long would it take for all of the current ones to be sold? And that's about 2.78 months. Uh, that's up about 15% since this summer. So we're seeing if we had a scale of uh, the seller's market on one side and a buyer's market on the other, we're seeing our market trend a little bit more toward a balanced in the middle market, but it's still pretty heavily a, a seller's market. So that's always a good kind of test, litmus test of where we're at. Uh, another stat that I like to share is list to sold percentage. So the price that is listed and then what is actually selling for. And in our area, we're still at about 98%. So a trusted real estate agent who knows how to, to come up with the market value for your home and help you market that and get exposure for your home usually brings in about 98% of what you list for. So if you're a buyer, that means you kind of need to go in at a, at a list price offer and be able to compete with other offers in that way. Um, the average amount of time that it's taking to sell is also another great indicator of where the market at. So for single family homes, is which all this data is based on, it's 22 days on the market, which is not bad at all. That's pretty fast. Okay. Uh, if you factor in mobile homes, if you factor in apartments or townhomes or, or things like that, the data changes a little bit, uh, but still a, a short term on the, a short time on the market there. Uh, another stat I like to pull is the median home price, all right? And in our area, that's about 330,000. Uh, so again, that means half the homes are selling for above that and half the homes are selling for below that, but it gives us kind of an indicator for where we're at. Um, so again, uh, those are the three main stats that I like to pull. It's subject to a little change depending on the home style. Uh, or, or home type, but great indicators for where we're at uh, in the real estate market this fall. If you have any questions, comments, feel free to write it in down below or reach out to me. My contact number uh, will be up there and uh, I would love to chat more specifically about your unique home situation. Hope you're having a great fall. Thanks.